Hey guys, in this video we're going to set up our PayPal plugin. So first of all, on your dashboard, click your account. And then click the settings one. And now you're going to add your PayPal business ID email here. So this is where you want your PayPal payments to go. And make sure you select your currency. Click save. Now if you want this to be different on each funnel, you can also change that in the funnel level by going to your funnel settings and adding a different email there. Now what we're going to want to do is go to our app section. So in your global app section, first make sure you turn on the PayPal plugin app. And you can choose if you want any of the PayPal cards logo or the PayPal card logo. And choose if you want to offer credit card or PayPal or both. So if you want to do just PayPal payments, you can turn off the credit card. Now also make sure you go to your funnel level and turn it on there. Again, you can do just select PayPal as a default payment option. And select here if you want to track your PayPal orders in ClickFunnels. We don't recommend this unless you're using an integration with ClickFunnels that absolutely will not integrate with Funnelish because this will prevent your orders to be tracked in Funnelish. So we don't recommend that unless absolutely necessary. Now this last step is not required, but we do recommend it. So you're going to want to go to your PayPal account, go to your settings, and then go to seller tools. Under website preferences, you can click update. And what we're setting up here is to make sure after they check out in PayPal that they are redirected right back to the next page in your funnel. So you can still sell them on your upsells and your downsells. So what you're going to want to do is click auto return on and here you're just going to add any URLs. Um, we recommend just like your home page, your basic funnel page URL, but what it will do is return them right back to where they were in your funnel. So add your URL there and then you are good to go. So we'll see what our PayPal looks like on our funnelish, our funnel. So here we go. Now they can select if they want to do credit card or PayPal, which they will be redirected to after they click complete order.